hi. Um, I thought I'd do a video of like coffin in bed. It's pretty much the same thing as like in my wheelchair, but I have a few tricks. <laughs> All right, so laying down, you know, um, like I said, I know pneumonia is like one of the main killers in quadriplegia. I haven't had pneumonia in about 15 years, so I kind of think I'm doing good. Um, at the end of the video, I will show you how the nurse cough assists me. But I, <laughs> when I first made the video in my chair, you know, I was a little uncomfortable coughing on, on camera. You don't have to give my legs. I'll do my candy cane so I can show them. But all right, so laying down, you know, if I go to cough. <laughs> now, if you watched in the one video um, when I was in my chair, I've learned, like, I only have the muscles right here on my chest. So when I take in a breath, it's only as much as my chest will let me do. But I can actually take, like, five breaths. And it'll totally fill my lungs. So check it out. And my cough gets better. So like one breath, it'd be like this. <clears throat> now watch. <clears throat> you know, doesn't that sound a lot better? All right. So another way that I cough, um, I'll, I got a chair here that I pull on. And I've realized it like helps make my muscles a little tighter. And then I kind of beat myself. So I'll pull on the chair and... <laughs> you know, you get a little bit more noise. If I didn't, if I didn't beat myself, this is what I sound like just do, pulling on the chair. <laughs> and that's like with one breath. So I'll do the five. <laughs> you know, it gives you more of an oomph, you know, it like helps clear your lungs out. You know, it gets like your breath all the way deep below. I know when I have had pneumonia, um, what usually happens is like my lower lobe um, on my left side ends up collapsing. So now I'll show you a couple other ways. I cough like three or four different ways yet. But uh, so I got my Theracane. Oops, chuck it across the bed. But I got my Theracane. I will use that. Oh, I gotta put the foot of my bed up. Hold on. So then my feet stay. Hold on. Yeah, to wiggle it under my thigh, I pull on here. I go like this and I push it into the bed. But I gotta put the foot of my bed up because then my feet actually stay. It's kind of cool. Oh. One moment, please. Alright, it's going up now. So, yeah. I've learned that I can cough with like just one leg up, too. And that kind of works the same. It like presses on, you know, my belly, which pushes my, <laughs> my quadriplegic belly up into, you know, like, and oops my lungs. But, like, yeah, here is the same way. You know, I'll pull on just one leg. <coughs> you know, and that's without even hitting me. You know, I mean, otherwise it's... <coughs> but just pulling my leg against my belly. <coughs> you know? And, um, alright, now you get to see two. And now I make a lot of noise. But, yeah, to get my other leg, I just hold on to this end. And I go right up underneath my knee, and I scoop it up. Not sure if you'll be able to see my knee in that video, but hold on. I'm almost ready for you. Okay. All right, so a lot of times when I'm in bed and I'm alone, I have my uh, cheater ice underneath my feet. So I usually put my left leg on my cheater ice, which holds it up a lot more. And then... Uh, I'm able to, like, I use the Theracane on one leg, and then I'll scoop up the other leg. But all right, I'm going to put my head up a little bit, too. I hate putting my head up, because as you see, the pillow goes out from under my head. That's the one thing I hate about, like, moving these. All right, now, I should be able to reach both legs and be able to scoop them up. Just so you know what to do, like, when you're alone. But yeah, so I got the Theracane. I take it, I grab this leg. And then I'll pull this knee close to me and, like, slide my hand down, catch up under my knee. And now I'll, I'll cough without, you know, as you saw. <clears throat> but now I can put both legs up against my belly, and it really oomphs it. But, yeah, so I'll do, like, the five breaths, and then you'll, you'll hear some noise. <laughs> <clears throat> you hear the second cough? That was only with one breath. You know, but, yeah, you know, I mean, um, I don't exhale in between them, but, yeah, like I said, it'll fill your lungs up and, you know, being a quad and just using just these chest muscles, you know, that's as much air as it'll, like, let you fill up. I just kind of learned that within the last year or two. 
But all right, we're going to do a cough assist again. I'm going to have the nurse, <laughs> Montana, push up my shirt. You even get to see my belly a minute. But she'll put her palm right in my belly button. And then her fingers, you see that? They're at like 2 o'clock. And this is my favorite way to cough in bed is to have both my legs. It like really helps you get things out. But um, as you saw in the chair video, she's going to count to three and push on four. Now when you count, you know, you want to keep it, you know, in good sequence. Because like as she counts to three, I inhale all three times. But like if you're working with somebody new, you know, just go slow with it, you know, and just, you know. You'll learn the oomph, but yeah, when she pushes in, she not only pushes in, but she kind of pushes up. So it's kind of like the Heimlich remover, rem remover maneuver. <laughs> but yeah, so you'll hear me get really loud, and I might even cough something up, so I'm sorry, but I know you got to learn. So you ready? All right. One, two, three. <coughs> 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 But yeah, as I did get something. I have a napkin, so I don't got to reach across the bed. But um, yeah, sometimes every time, like she'll push because she can feel like me inhale after that. Usually, sometimes we get like a deeper breath in. But I've been talking, so. But I know, like I said, with myself, I can't get all that air in and like to oomph it out too. So it's kind of really nice when you know you got somebody that you trust enough to you know allow you to do it, you know what I mean? Just take it slow with the cough assisting. I'm going to have her do it one more time for us. But um, take it slow with it because I think you can like rupture or get a hernia or something and, you know. But I'll tell you right now, you know, I can get, it's it's nice to have other people beat me because, um, yeah, sometimes I just can't get it out. All right, I'll end with one more time. You'll see kind of the smoothness of it now that I'm not talking. Ready? One, two, three. <coughs> 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 nope, not getting much out. And I've been coughing, so it probably sounded a little bit funny. But, yeah, I thought I'd give you, like, my take on it. And I've been paralyzed for 23 years, and um, we learned from UW-Madison. So, you know, I just thought I'd pass it on. So, until next time, take care.